With breaking news, and right now a West Michigan daycare's operating license is suspended after allegations of child sex crimes happening inside that home. News Channel 3 broke the story tonight at 5, and our Lauren Springer is live in Three Rivers with the latest. Lauren. Well, Andy, state police tell us they launched this investigation about a week ago now. All of this happening after a toddler went to their parents saying that they'd been inappropriately touched at this daycare. And since then, several other families have now come forward. What y'all molested my kid? Why was my daughter acting like that? I knew something was going on. This Three Rivers mother arriving here at her children's daycare on 7th Street in hysterics. I just got a phone call on the, uh, about this. Reacting to the news that the man who lives here is being investigated by state police for criminal sexual conduct. My daughter was screaming and crying for no reason. I know it was because of that. The man at the center of the claims did not want to go on camera. Uh, regarding a police investigation? Oh, uh, don't know anything about it, sorry. Are you her boyfriend? No, I don't know anything about it. Telling News Channel 3 he'd never heard a child here at Abracadabra's daycare requesting a lie detector test. I asked them what was wrong because I had a concern about my baby. This mother not so sure. How old are you? My daughter is one and my son is six. State police say a handful of families with kids ages 3 to 12 have now come forward saying their kids were mistreated. My daughter was screaming, crying, like screaming, crying. And I asked her, like, what was wrong? Like, Abracadabra's license now suspended by the state. I knew something was wrong. I just felt it. My daughter can't talk. She here all day, every day. MSP says the owner of the daycare tried to take her life last week, just days after the complaint was filed. She's expected to be released from the hospital tomorrow. Once again, state police tell us they are still in the very early stages of this investigation. They plan to spend the next few days interviewing the children that attended this daycare. They say once they complete their report, they'll then hand it, hand it over to the prosecutor for potential charges. Reporting live tonight in Three Rivers, Lawrence Springer, News Channel 3.